to our channel. Today's video, you're gonna see how to put cute top knot for your Shih Tzus. In this video, I'm also gonna talk about small tips for you how to groom them and keep them really cute. If you're new to our channel, welcome. This is Pavi, and you're watching The Cuteness Factory. Let's get in the video. Today, we have Muffin. Our Shih Tzu is 11 months old on our grooming table. This is exactly not a grooming table. This is just a study table. You can convert any table into your grooming table. And I'm just having a small up towel so that she can put her hair down when we are going to put her top knot. So for putting a top knot, you can buy brushes like these. This one has both the short bristles and the long bristles. Like the gap is different. Like this sort of brush is really helpful for you to groom their coat. So you can use the bigger side to groom their body hair, which is like, this is so comfortable. Place your Shih Tzu's head on the roll of pillow. They get really comfortable and to the sleeping posture. So now use the smaller part and then start combing their hair backwards. You want to keep a level of the eye level. So you want to make sure that you're taking parts of the hair exactly between their eyes. Always make sure that they're really comfortable in this position. If they're struggling or moving away, just give them a treat or so. You want to start this process in a very early stage so that they get used to you doing this and not feel really uncomfortable. Once your Shih Tzu gets used to this, they're going to just sleep in the grooming. After you're, you're sure that you're taken all the hair from the eye portion that you want to put in your top knot, comb it smoothly so that you make sure you have no knots or anything of that sort. Because near the eye, they have this eye watering, so there will be a lot of small knots. You just want to gently release everything and make sure the hair is nicely brushed. For the top knot, I'm going to use three rubber bands. These rubber bands can be just any plastic rubber band you just get in the store for papers. So you just need three equal sized rubber bands. First, what you do is take the hair session till the mid of their head so what you do is so you've taken the hair from eye to eye level and you're going to take the hair till the mid of their head so now we have taken the session of hair just this is their year, so the crown is like before the starting of the year, just exactly where the year starts. So we have taken hair right above their eyes. Leave their eyelashes, you don't want to disturb that. And then you gotta take all the hair into a nice ponytail. you put I put three times you need not put more because we're gonna add another rubber band to secure it next session I'm gonna take is from the ear to the back of their head the reason I told you to keep their hair really brushed is for this if their hair is not really brushed well then this part will become like really difficult to take the sessions this is gonna go till their neck so move away the hair that you don't want Again, you want to make sure that you're not tugging on the ears. You want to leave their ears free because if you tug in the ears, they're just going to scratch and they will want to release it themselves. And then 
your entire phony is gonna be spoiled, which you don't want. Put three knots to secure this rubber band. And what you wanna do is you wanna add both these rubber bands together into one ponytail. You don't want to do this because that will pull the eyes. You just want to put these two together like this. You take in the third rubber band and you just hold the both ponytails together and you add the third rubber band inside. Again, just put three and then just comb all the hair together and there is a beautiful ponytail <gasps> baby girl if you feel the eyes are tough then just you can like go in and just pull out some hair so that the eyes are not tugged too much she's so sleepy now you can add any sort of hair accessories because i have too many hair accessories that are left out from my childhood so i just like adding those under her it's just like my memories so i have just put a small tiny catch clip of mine on her and finally you just want to brush out all the hair that's sticking in and around the ears the end of the video leave us a huge like showing all your love and support click the red subscribe button down below and don't forget to ring the bell so that you get notified on our further videos hope this video was informative and helpful for all the shih tzu owners to put a cute top on then it's bye from me and muffin see you on another one